Hi, I'm Malika and I'm always being asked, how did I remain so positive through breast cancer? And you know, how, how are you, why are you always positive? How did you do it? You, you know, and how I did it is by practice. Um, I've always been positive, but it's not easy to remain positive all the while, especially when you're going through something like chemotherapy and the, the, um, the whole treatment for breast cancer. But I know that it is proven that by having a positive attitude, you can literally improve the quality of your life. I know that because I've, it's affected my life in a positive way. And there have been times when I've been very down, very low and depressed in my life. And this prior to breast cancer, many years ago, actually, which is many years. Um, so I can say that I can relate to both sides of that pendulum swing that is our moods but um, however I know that it's not always possible to be happy but anything that helps you cope is worthwhile positivity helped me cope it helps me cope with lots of lots of everyday things you know those bills that come through the door the endless things that you've got to do especially you know as a woman as a mother the positivity is the only way for me you know it helps me cope with that the uh, the the queue in in the supermarket when everyone's huffing and tutting and you know I, I just don't join in in all that because I'm there thinking about other things that are um, enlightening my life so anything that helps you cope is worthwhile okay and you can choose how you feel you can choose how you feel and how you are going to approach your treatment you can that you can decide that this is really crap. I hate, I hate this. I hate everything. Why is this happening to me? You can be in that mindset if that's what works for you. But the reality is your body and your mind are connected. So that that's just, that's, not, that's real. I didn't make that up. So um, your body and your mind are connected. So what you're thinking up here somehow sends messages and waves and vibrations through the rest of your body. So the more that you fill up here with positive thoughts, good things, fill your mind with affirmations, you know, read, read these amazing quotes and statements that lift you, that keep you going through the day, give you the hope to carry on. Because at the end of it all, that is that is what matters. All right, so I just, I wish for you that during those days where you, you're finding it hard to be positive and be happy, that you remember that that day is just one day of many, okay? And the next day you have the chance to, and the opportunity to wake up and decide how that's going to go for you. Um, you know, I'm a life coach. This is what I do. Um, if you want to find out more about me and how I, how I how I can help you do that, um, you can always search me out on my website, and um, I share as much as I can through that and my Facebook. I wish you a healthy life.